Thanks, Matt. You might have seen him around Main Street in Bozeman with a cardboard sign, a local business owner begging people to sell him a home. Yeah, MTM's Gabby Krevit caught up with the hopeful first time home buyer to hear his family's challenges and frustrations in their search for a house. We've heard about it for months and months. The inventory of available houses for sale in Bozeman is low. And for this young family with a baby on the way, their dream house can't come soon enough. I'm just asking for someone to sell us a home. Uh, my sign says, please sell me a home. You may have seen Sean Hawksford strolling down Main Street with a cardboard sign, asking for leads on a house for sale. Hawksford owns a successful business in Bozeman and lives comfortably with his wife in a small, yet cozy 400 square foot house they rent in downtown Bozeman. The couple says they feel fortunate and privileged, but want to establish permanent roots in a community they work in and love. It's been about six months. We've made, I think, 18 offers now on different properties and haven't had one accepted yet. It's been a little bit tough with them and all of my first time home buyers, to be honest with you. Sean and Jessica's realtor, Jeff Bent with Obsidian Realty Group, has been working with the couple from the start. Quite often um, they get qualified for a certain number and the market has been changing so quickly that what they got qualified for no longer meets what they want to buy. And so we kind of have to adjust their expectations at some point. Hawksford says people have generally been receptive to his signs, which he says highlights a more complex problem in the current state of the market. I think the most frustrating thing about that is not that we have been making low ball offers or non-competitive offers because we can't afford it or don't have a high enough budget. Uh, we've had a lot of experience of getting beat just narrowly by somebody who either has an entirely cash offer or who has more of a, a down payment than we do or are in a position to waive contingencies that we can't. If a property comes on the market, it's going to be gone in about three days. If, you know, and, and probably it's going to have multiple offers on it during that three-day period. So as long as it's not it's just out of the realm of possibility priced, it's going to get activity and it's going to probably go above asking price. Hawksford says he's optimistic and hopes to have a home by the time his son is born later in the summer. There's days when it feels like uh, we're never going to find a house, but we're optimistic still and I, I'm confident. Reporting in Bozeman, Gabby Krevit, MTN News. Now, according to the Gallatin and uh, Association of Realtors, homes are spending significantly less time on the market compared to this time last year. As you can see, the number of new listings for a single family in Gallatin County down about 5% compared to January of 2020. The average days on the market decreased by almost 63% from last year, and inventory of available homes has dropped to almost 67%.